Hey everyone, what's up? This is Andy from My Tech Methods back with another video. Today I just want to quickly show you how to use Smart Converter. It's a free app for Mac to convert audio files and video files. This is a really great program. There's a free version and there's a paid version. Today I'm just going to go over the free version. It's done everything I, that I've needed it to do so far, so I, I've, I've just stuck with the free. Now this does require 10.7 or 10.8 on your Mac, that's uh, Lion or Mountain Lion. So make sure you, you have that. You can go up here to your Apple icon, click About This Mac, and this will show you what, what version you have. If you have 10.7 or 10.8 here, you'll be good. If you have those two, any of those two versions, you can go to the Mac App Store, and then you can search Smart Converter, and this will, this will pop up, and then you just install it. Mine's already installed. So I'm gonna close out of here. Okay, so let's open Smart Converter from our dock. So this is what you see when Smart Converter opens. It uh, has a bunch of presets that you can select from depending on what you're converting your file for. So if you're converting uh, anything to an mp3 or audio format, you're going to select music. If you're converting something for video, a certain video format to another video format, you'll want to select which format you want depending on you know what you're going to put it on. So if you, if you want to put the video on an iPhone or iPod, of course you're going to select that and just select any of these presets. Or you can select other and, and just choose a, a custom one here. Usually I use this app just to convert video files to MP3s. So say if I got this music video over here, the, the video file, just drag it over to the Smart Converter box, drop it. I'll select music and then I'll hit convert. And what it does, it converts the video to MP3 opens my iTunes, automatically sends it to it. And if you want to see where the file ends up, if you're converting a, a video that's not automatically going into iTunes, you click the show file button and it'll bring up your finder and this will have your exported video or audio file, whichever one you converted in the smart converter folder. And you can copy it and paste it wherever you want to, wherever you want to put it. So there it is. It's super quick, super easy. And best of all, it's free. If you enjoyed this tutorial, if it helped you out, please uh, help me out by clicking the like button below this video and subscribe if you want more videos like this. I'll be talking to you guys soon. Thanks. Bye.